Bom dia, friends! I'm so happy to have you over here today because this video is a fire, you guys. I have been on the market for a good belt bag for quite a while now and I think I found the one. If you guys are new here, my name is Karina. I am so excited that you stopped by the channel. I hope that this review is super helpful to you guys. As I mentioned, I have been on the market for quite a while for a belt bag. I was rocking my Gucci baby or like kid friendly belt bag for quite a while, 2019, 2020, but it is a little bit too kitty. You know, if you know what I mean, it is under $500 and I'm gonna leave the link down here. I'll try to find some photos of it for you guys because it is, it's a great purchase, it's roomy, it's got an elastic um, belt, so it's very adjustable. And since it's children's, I'd say it fits a, a woman's size up to maybe a size six. So hopefully that's helpful to you guys. I no longer have the bag, I sold it um, a few months ago, unfortunately, because I would like to actually do a review and I'm not actually might purchase another one you guys because they do have some other designs that are super cute and it is a really good belt bag to own but like I said it's kind of like prints and drawings and cute little kids stuff and it. it's very colorful uh, and I wanted something a little simpler a little more chic a little more neutral to go with my uh, outfits from like you know something that's a little more casual and sporty to things that I can actually wear at night and go out for dinner and things like that I also have my Balenciaga belt bag. Do let me know if you wanna review, I still have that bag. It's actually men's and it's amazing. It's massive and every time I'm like traveling and if I'm flying, uh, that's the one that I carry with me. I can carry like my passport. It fits so much in there and I highly, highly recommend. It is a canvas material, so it's just kind of like sportier, you know, if you know what I mean. But today's video i actually came across this guy i think that she's brand new on the market because i have not and i've been looking at bottega's like website non-stop and when i laid my eyes on this i had to have it so let's do this friends if you do follow me on instagram you have seen the reel that i am actually unboxing this that's the real unboxing i just put her back in the box just for the sakes of this video i uh, wanted to show you the presentation that the box came in it did come in the box the box is a little bit ripped in here so like not the best but i don't i really don't care about that they actually even sent their shopper bag which is so nice it has like snap buttons in it let me actually show you guys because it's good So they sent a massive box just so it could fit their shopper in here. And it, this is, obviously it's paper, but it has like snap little buttons on the sides. I think it's such a nice presentation to me. It matters, you know, I think when you're spending this kind of money on a handbag, you want something nice, you know, and so I don't mind the nice treatment in here and this is just a beautiful bag that you can save for storage you know in your office or things like that it does have a little bit of Jean Paul's hair in here but anyway so then it comes in the in their like gift box I did not request this to be gifted so I'm assuming that if you do it will probably come with a bow or something extra but just know that it is available and then the dust bag love the dust bag it's very cute very italian you know with the bottega in green it's just like a really nice smooth dust bag a uh, very different than the ones that i have i have some ysl chloe's you know just not as fancy i'd say as bottegas and so they're just a little bit different this is a really nice dust bag i think i usually usually use my dust bags for like when i'm traveling to put um bathing suits or like underwear bras and things like that and this will be probably like one of a good one for like undies and things are a little more delicate and uh you guys how pretty is she i am so excited i i'm so silly but i just get overly excited first of all i love the almonds this is the name of the color of the cassette bag so this is the cassette 
belt bag. You can find this as mini as well. Men's have a lot of options as well. This one is that like lambskin leather. It's just so soft, so beautiful. Uh, probably will show markings if I'm being quite honest. I don't care. I think it adds to the character of the bag. It makes, you know, like it shows how much wear you get out of it. If you guys want something to be, you know, not to show any wear, this might not be good for your everyday bag, but I, I just love it. I think this collar is the most beautiful neutral collar that I have seen. I stopped at Bottegas in um, Miami when I went with the girls back in January, almost purchased the bag. Not this one, because they didn't have it, but it was just pricey and uh, you know, the one that I wanted did not have, they did not have the almond in store. So I decided to wait and I'm actually glad I did because I finally got this. It would not make sense for me to get this if I had the bigger size of it. And I think that this as a belt bag is gonna go with so, so much. I've gotten this about a week ago and I already wore it like maybe with three or four outfits. And you know, by the time this video goes live, it will be another five outfits. This is how much I am wearing this baby right here. So I'm gonna do a quick review of what fits into her, give you a little bit of like a close up on this girl. Okay, so the presentation comes, you know, with the, you saw the presentation, how it comes. It does have the magnetic closure in here. I do have the um, stuffing. I keep the stuffing in my bags nowadays, guys, I have learned the, the hard way because this one will show all the markings um, of wear. So try to keep in there as much as you can. It is this um, made with the Bottega Veneta's signature. I think it's called Intrecciato leather. So it's the Napa leather and the Intrecciato is this weave that they have that's just their signature. I know that there's a lot of bags outside, you know, like dupes out there on Amazon. I actually have one. But when you actually look at the real one, it's just so much prettier and it just makes you appreciate just a beautiful designer bag. You know, it's like, it's something to be appreciated and celebrated, I should say. So here is the back of the bag. It does, the, the belt does detach from the bag itself. So can you actually put a chain through it? Yeah, I think, I think that you can. Can you actually wear this as a belt? I don't see why you couldn't, like it's totally doable. It comes with like 15 pins. So the one thing that I was a little bit disappointed is that it does not come with a buckle. It is just this little, um, pin in here and it goes in the different holes, you know, for adjusting. So it's easy to adjust. Like I said, the leather is so, so, so smooth. That worries me a little bit because I, like I said, I'm gonna, I'm planning on wearing this a whole lot and I'll give you guys a little follow up if you guys want to, like here in a couple of months on where, how it's going and, and things like that. I just think it's worth trying. I don't, I really don't care if it's gonna destroy her because I just wanna wear the heck out of her. I also wore it as a um, cross body, so, or cross chest, I don't even know how you would call this. And it does fit quite well on the last, um, on the last hole in here. It's really cute. I used to have the YSL Lulu bag. Um, I'll try to find a picture for you here. I actually sold that as well. I didn't like that because it was way too boxy. So it stood out too much. It did fit, you know, a, a fair amount of things, but it was just way too bulky for like a really thin strap. And this is about the same price. I think that one was 1100. This one is 1250. So I would much rather have this and without the logo or anything, it's just very simplistic and minimalist. Bottega, I love, love, love. And as far as size, I think it fits, it doesn't fit a whole lot, but it fits my needs, you know? So it's probably about the same as, Lu as the mini Lulu from, from YSL. So I also want to show you guys inside. It has one flap pocket. And I'm not sure if this one detaches because she did show me, probably not, at the store, the one that was detachable, but this one is not. It has like a bit of a, almost looks like a button in here. And it has the Bottega, not engraved, but like stamped in here. 
and the authenticity card and here's where you see the belt looping through so quite easy to kind of remove this belt if you do want to wear just the belt or even if you want to carry this guy as a clutch you guys it's easy i feel like there's about three different uses it usages or ways to wear um, on this bag here. Do let me know if you want like a styling video on the different ways. To me that justified, I think that this is something I had been wanting for a long time. So I could make, you know, I could justify the purchase. It does, the Bottega uh, comes engraved or stamped in this, um, in the belt as well. And it's just like a really pretty, pretty, pretty. I guess you guys know that I'm already in love, right? Okay, so let's see what fits in here. I have quite a large uh, cell phone. This is the biggest one. And I do have a massive pop socket in here. So what I do is just, I, I put it in like this, like the facing, the smooth part or the flat part facing the back. And so in here, I will put my wallet and that's it. You can fit the car key. I mean, pretty nice. I'll, I'll, you know, I'll take the ring off of it and maybe a lip gloss. Yeah, we can do it. Lip gloss. So this is like a going out at night. If you're carrying this as a clutch or you know just as as the belt keep in mind that the cell phone is very heavy and because of the leather being so delicate and smooth um, it might wear it down so I usually keep my phone on my hands anyway it's just nice to arrive in a place like this and then I'll most likely like remove my cell phone so just basically fits my phone my uh, card holder the like a lip gloss in my car keys now another thing you guys keep in mind that if you need to fit something else in there you can just carry my card holder is quite chubby like it's a it's a dual card holder so you can just maybe carry your id in your card in the flat pockets in here and maybe remove the case of your phone or maybe you don't have an obnoxious pop socket in here and it will fit more this is what it fits at the most so just you know as a heads up it is quite roomy for a belt bag that it's this small um and you can make more efficient i guess i was gonna show you with just like say if you carry your phone in your hands and just once like the lip like a lipstick and a lip gloss you know definitely does not fit sunglasses unless it's just the wall or unless you do just the card holder you know and then you can do your sunglasses in here but lipstick and this is a lot lighter too but you know i don't have the cell phone inside of there so quite roomy you guys and it is a lot like thinner so compared to the ysl lulu that i used to have that was bulky and it just came forward too much to me this one is just a lot more compact i think that it fits it falls on the body a lot nicer too it just has a little drop um you can see in some of the pictures i'll show you that it's just more flattering to me it's not it doesn't add much bulk obviously for women the last thing you want is add a bunch of stuff on your you know waistline um so this one just has a nice little fall to it like a nice little drop that looks very feminine and elegant and to me is just a winner all all over all around i don't know what do you guys think? I am dying to know if you guys are loving this as much as I am. As I mentioned before, this is this has been hard to find. The only website that I found this, this particular color on available is at the Bottega Veneta's website. I am linking a couple of different colors in there too. Other retailers have different colors and different styles of the Bottega belt bag. So it comes in a little dumpling one, which has the chain. It's a little more dressy. It's a little smaller. There's a million in ways that you can actually wear that one uh, but this one is just more me it's just more minimal just a, a, I feel like a little more elegant and timeless than the dumpling one and it comes now I think Nordstrom has the one with the V and it's a canvas one. It's a little more expensive than this a little bulkier like bigger and it's canvas it's not this beautiful leather in here so 
just letting you know what's available out there maybe by summer they will come out with more colors and this will be more widely available but at this point just the site you know just the Bottega sites its own and that's it for today's video you guys I hope that you enjoy the mini cassette Bottega Veneta's review first impressions ways to style make sure you leave me a thumbs up if you did enjoy the video and I'll see you guys next time um beijo tchau tchau